Hi, it's Lynette here, and today I've got a rather massive savers haul. Now, I tried to film this last week, but for some reason the day I was trying to film it, I was absolutely exhausted and all I was doing was yawning. Um, so I thought I'd film it today, but the weather is, oh, the sky is just grey, it's awful. Now, <laughs> this is one of my spare rooms, so behind me it's got this little window and I don't see the point in it. Um, it's got this little window and another window, um, but it faces on just to the, the next door house. So all you can see is brick, but I suppose it, it, it can give in some light some days. But it's so grey. So I've got the ring light on and um, yeah, I look rather shiny as a result. So anyway, I am going to try and find my receipt. Here it is. I'm breaking it and I'll go through the items. Now there's a lot of cleaning cleaning products and shower gels here but in total I spent £30.52 and the bag weighs a ton um, there's already an item taken out it and that was the shortbread and that's all been eaten <laughs> rather nice so I'm just going to put all the items out one by one and let you see what I get or let you see what I bought and the first item I picked up was this rather large fairy it's clean and fresh pink jasmine and um, it's 1190ml, there you go, so that was £2, I think that's the cheapest I've ever seen it for this size, my husband usually buys it, I think I've only bought it a couple of times, but I'm sure £2 is a really good price, I decant it into a smaller one that I keep in the kitchen, um, yeah, because I just can't get on at all with my dishwasher, I've never had one before in my life, um, and yeah, I just... Uh, yeah, I just struggle with it to be honest with you. You've got to fill it up and you've got to let it run for what seems like two hours and then you've got to empty it. So I'd rather just do the dishes as I'm going along anyway. So I picked up these. You know how I like the um, colour catchers. So these are Dr. Magic Snatch a Dye um, and they're colour catchers. Um, there's 20 in here, but these were only a pound. Yeah, we're only a pound, which I think is really good. If I could find it again, but no, definitely only a pound. So I thought I'll pick some up. I just picked up one. I just usually pop into Savers when I have to go into um, town to pick up my prescription. Now, I love the Wella Shockwaves, Curling Waves Moves. However, I usually only get it when it's two for four pound. Um, Superdrug usually do the offers regularly. So I'll pick it up. I'll pick up about four or six then. However, this was only two pound. So I've got two for four pounds. So now that I know that they sell it for two pounds all the time and not just on offer, I'll pick it up from there. Just need to persuade Steve to take me into town again. I also picked up this. Now this is a larger size than I got before. It's a Palm Olive Japanese Gardens. So you've probably seen this in one of my empties videos. I absolutely love the smell of this. Now I love cherry blossom anyway. But this was much bigger than the other one, so it should hopefully last longer. This is 500 mils, and this was, I think it was one, 149. Um, so I thought that was a really good price. Do you know, today I'm not going to be able to find anything, but I have yet 149. <laughs> if I'd done it straight after, once I brought them home, I probably would have remembered most of the prices. I needed a new conditioner, because I don't know about you guys, but I managed to get through conditioner before I get through shampoo um, so I picked up the L'Oreal El Viv and it's extraordinary oil and they're made from 100% recycled plastic bottles which I think is fantastic I think if a bottle's recyclable that's great but when they're starting to make the bottles from recycled plastic that's even better I know we want to try and avoid single-use plastics but I like this it's a nourishing conditioner with precious flower oils and um, it's for dry to very dry hair now, I'm sure this fits in with the curly girl method that I've been loosely trying to follow. And I don't think it has the itchy M's in it, but I will need to check. And um, this was £2.49. But I thought that was quite a good price. They do a whole variety of shampoos. I mean, it's like, I think a pound upwards. Um, but they do all the brands that you would pick up in boots and things. So I picked up this Inset Dry Shampoo in Blossom. Now, I always like to keep one of these in the house. And it was one pound. Um, and I know that Antonia likes the smell of this, so I don't use dry shampoo because 
I have to wash my hair every day, um, otherwise it's just <laughs> crystal tips, there's nothing on me. But um, I picked this up one time and um, Antonia had used it and said it was lovely. Now, they're not allowed to stay over at the moment, they're in Glasgow anyway, so they've got their own flat. But I just thought, you know, for times when they might be able to come and stay again, I'll pop one. They've got a cupboard in the, the bathroom where I just keep all the things for them, so that if they ever come and stay, they don't need to be worrying about bringing toothbrushes, shampoo, conditioner, um, dry shampoo, hairspray, mousse, anything like that. So I just, I just think it's nice to feel like home from home when you're, when you're away. And the smell of this is gorgeous. I don't know why I'm showing you the cap. The smell is gorgeous and it's really nice. So I know that she really liked to use that. So that's only a pound. An inset reminds me of my mum. Um, <laughs> that was the only hairspray she would use, the blue and white tin. Um, I don't know if she still uses as much of it, but we used to say she damaged the ozone layer around the house. Now I picked up three more um, shower gels. Now I absolutely love these. It's the original source, but it's the water infusions. So I got one free in a glossy box. I think it was in the Christmas box. Um, and raspberry and rose water. And ever since then, I've kind of been hooked. I remember going out my way because Tesco had them on offer and picking up about eight or something. Um, the pineapple and lemon zest and um, the apple and melon. So I don't know if I've tried the apple and melon, but they've all got really nice... Um, they've all We've got a lovely fragrance now it's all natural fragrance as well it's vegan which doesn't necessarily mean cruelty free but i hope it is um it's got no parabens in it and it's kind of really good for your skin but it's just i don't know this sounds really daft some shower gels are just shower gels right lush shower gels are amazing so I'm not saying they're as good as Lush shower gels, but to me, they're kind of almost there. So it, it feels really nice to me when I'm using them. I love the smell, I love the texture, I love the, the feeling. Um, so yeah, that's the only way I can describe it. And rather than paying eight pound, I'll pay the pound. Um, yeah, I'm sure those were a pound. Yeah, that's a pound. Honestly, I can't see for looking at it. I also picked up, Steve must be loving this because he always buys all the, <laughs> he buys all the shopping, which usually includes all the household stuff. But when I go to Savers and Home Bargains and B&M, I'm usually buying everything for a haul. So I, I'll throw it in with that. Now I've tried the, um, I've used stuff for years, but I've just recently got into these capsules. Now, this is a two-in-one capsule, and it's Tropical Lily with Yul and Ylang Ylang. Um, so it's it's cleaning and conditioning. So there is how many capsules in here? Does it tell you? 20 bio capsules. Now, if you've got wee kids, keep them safe because they're really dangerous. If they Even if they burst them in front of themselves, they can get a really bad burn. So so keep them kind of, keep them somewhere safe. But that was um, 2 99 which I thought was really good. I also picked up one of these cloths. Um, I like to use different coloured cloths for different rooms, but I thought this one might be quite nice just for the kitchen. It's um, an antibacterial pad. And it's pink. <laughs> I love the fact it's pink. So it's it's also got the scratchy side on the other side. So that was about a pound. I know you can get cheaper ones. Um, yeah, that was a pound. I know you can get cheaper ones. I've, I've picked up some other ones that are um, two for a pound type of thing. But I I like the look of this one. So I thought I'll just throw it in there. I also, I get these every time I go. They're Wisdom um, Interdental Cleaning Brushes. So they're really good. I like them. Um, I'm not sure these two pound fifty nine, but I've got quite big gaps in between my teeth, so floss doesn't really cut it for me, or those little picks. Um, the only way to kind of stop um, plaque for building for me is by using these, um, and they're fine. Um, but just brushing because all my all, 
the majority of my teeth are crowns um, so they can get a bit gappy at the bottom so I find that's really really good um, so I'm really hoping next time I can see the dentist which is the 1st of November in Scotland um, unless you're private practice they're regulated differently you can see the private practice now I think um, but I'm really hoping that the next time I go in for my checkup I don't actually need to have a scale and polish but we'll see if they do then they're working their magic I also picked up this dental surface cleanser it um, kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria and viruses. Now it's 750 mils and it was only £1.49. Now for a long time I couldn't actually pick any of this up. Now the good thing about Dettol is it's... I use a lot of antibacterial spray in the kitchen. However, it's only antibacterial. It doesn't kill viruses. Um, Dettol will kill viruses. Now this is particularly good obviously because we're talking about having coronavirus, COVID-19 um, and it will kill um, the, the COVID virus um, is one of the things that it will, will actually kill off um, which I think is really good but it's also got no bleach either and no taint which means that if you pop something down so if say you put your sandwich on your counter um, obviously once it's dried in but um, it won't leave a taint on your surfaces. So yeah, for £1.49, I picked this up. I'll still use my antibacterial surface spray, but that's really good just to kind of make sure. See if you've gone to the shops and you want to spray down your shopping or where your bags have been on, things like that. It's really good for that. Just really good to have it in the house as well. I picked up one of these Sure um, antiperspirants for Steve. And I also picked up, so I'm... I can't be running out of mascara, but I can't find my mascaras. So I picked up this Maybelline Classic Volume Express. It's waterproof um, and it was only something like, how much was it here? I picked it up actually as I was at the till. So £4.98. Um, so I'm hoping this is good because um, I've run out. I'm running out of my mascaras and I can't find any of my other mascaras. So I don't know what I've done with them. I know I've got the tart one. The lights, camera, action, which is amazing. Um, and I've got the Better Than Sex waterproof one, which I'm not a massive fan of. But I cannot find them for the life of me. So I thought I'll buy this just now anyway. And I hope I find the other ones before they kind of go out of date. So, yep, that was my savers haul. So as you see, it's it's mainly kind of a cleaning haul and um, things like shampoo, conditioner, mousse and... Um, shiver gel I didn't actually think of the word but I know that you like to have a wee look at the hauls when I get them and see what's on offer and all of that for £30 I think it's fantastic and that included this wee bag which is 49 pence now um I always have a carrier bag in my bag but this was going to be too heavy for my plastic carrier bag so I bought one of these but I need to drop off a whole load of books at the charity shop and I thought actually rather than putting them in plastic bags that might break I can put them in these kind of bags um, and the charity shop can reuse them um, so it's kind of when when Anna managed to get all to the car without it breaking the bag so anyway guys thank you so much for watching and I'll speak to you soon take care bye